Hello everyone and welcome to this animation on Capture on the Go. In this animation we'll be talking about all the different prerequisites and the parts that make up the Capture on the Go solution and in other animations we'll be exploring how to actually test and implement your Capture on the Go documents and how to process their data. So let's start by explaining the different moving parts involved in Capture on the Go. There are four main parts to Capture on the Go. The first one is the either Planet Press Connect or a Prez Connect installation. More specifically, you need to have the designer module, and this is where you will design the documents that will be used on the mobile application. The second part is the workflow module, so either Planet Press workflow or Prez workflow, and this will be used to create the processes that will be used to transmit data to the mobile application and receive the information that is sent from that same application. Now one specific requirement of the workflow module is that it must have some communication with the uh, internet as well as with the mobile application. That means, of course, it needs the internet connection and it also needs uh, to have either a Wi-Fi connection where the mobile application will access it, so an IP address that's accessible through the Wi-Fi, or it needs to have a public facing IP. This is because the mobile application needs to be able to send the data directly to workflow, so that's going to be either through the Wi-Fi or through the internet on that workflow IP. You also need to have the mobile device, as I mentioned, this can be either a tablet or a phone, and it needs to have Android or iOS on it. We currently do not support Windows Phone systems. And the very last part is that you need to have a Capture on the Go license. The Capture on the Go license is essentially the central part of it. It gives you access to the Capture on the Go server where you will create your users and where you can access and manage the users, the documents, the groups, as well as the categories. Now, good news, if you have a Prez or Planet Press Connect license, you do have access to a, a free three uh, Capture on the Go user licenses for free for a year. Just click on the button that is on the welcome screen and that will bring you to the page where you can request this free account. Now that I've explained all the different parts, I'll explain to you how they work together. Essentially, you start by creating your template within the Connect Designer. So here we have a Capture on the Go template, which is provided to you and you can change and modify and adjust to your own liking inside the Connect Designer. So you create this form or you modify one of our existing templates and then you will send this form to the Planet Press workflow application. Inside of Planet Press workflow, there will be three main processes that will be managing your Capture on the Go solution. The first one is a process that sends the documents to the Capture on the Go server. The second one will generate the document and send it to the mobile application when requested. And the third one will be receiving the data from the mobile application and processing it and doing something with it. We'll explore these processes and how they work in the third animation about the automation. The third part is the Capture on the Go server. Now this is accessed through your browser by going to config-us.captureonthego.com as you can see on the screen. When you log in with the repository ID and password, which is given to you when you get your Capture on the Go license, this is where you will be able to manage everything. For example, seeing all the documents that are inside of your repository, as well as managing different users. The fourth and final part of this whole solution is the Capture on the Go mobile application. Now within the Capture on the Go mobile application, you have access to the two main part, let's say, would be the repository and the library. The repository will give you access to all the documents that are on the server. The second important section is the library, where you see all the documents that are downloaded to the mobile device. And this is it for explaining the different parts of the Capture on the Go solution. Obviously, we're going to take a look 
at these different parts in the following animations. So stay tuned to get more information. We are next going to take a look at the designer module and how to create your own forms, send them to the workflow as well as directly to the Capture on the Go mobile application. See you in a few clicks.